This video is about Copilot for admins. If you have seen the new Copilot interface, you'll have noticed the admin button there. If you don't see the admin button, just go to apps, click on all apps, then you will see admin, click on the three dots and say pin. So when you go to admin center, there is a Copilot pane which will open. In case it doesn't open, click this Copilot button. I'm going to make that pane bigger so that we can learn better. So when you click on the view prompt button, it will give you broad categories of what it can do and then you can select what you want. So let's take some examples. I'm asking it, how do I remove a user who has left the company? It gives me a step by step procedure and also gives relevant links. So I can go to a particular link and follow the instructions. It doesn't just give links. Here is a useful one. I want to know who are global admins. Now it gives me a list. But again, this list is in Copilot pane. What do I do with it? I will need to open them in proper admin center user list. No problem. That's why there are actionable buttons. Show in active users is one action or you can export it to Excel. So click on it. It will open the users in admin center. Another generic but useful one is recap what admin center can do. Admin center gets lots of new features on a continuous basis. So recap may be a good idea to make sure you are not missing some important and useful feature. Here is another one. You can ask specific questions like how to make org more secure and then it will actually open the relevant guide. In this case, it's going to open the zero trust guide and then you follow instructions. Probably all of you will benefit from this which licenses I am paying for, but they are not assigned. That's literally like tearing money, right? So it will give you a list and view all licenses will take you to actual license center where you can either remove the unwanted licenses or assign it to relevant users. But that's not all. Copilot itself understands programming languages, including PowerShell. And as you know, PowerShell is the favorite language for admins. So let me show you an example. I am asking it to give me a PowerShell script to block multiple users in bulk. I have the list in CSV. So it goes ahead, builds the code. I just have to copy paste it in the shell and run it. It's also giving me the format of CSV and the prerequisites. But that's not all. After you do something, Copilot is thinking on your behalf and saying, are there any related activities I can suggest? Now the reverse is also true. Maybe I have blocked users and whatever the problem is now solved, and I want to unblock them. In this case, is creating a new PowerShell script with uh, account enabled true instead of false. And that's it. I'm sure you found this useful. So that's it for now. See you soon. Thank you.